Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and the cheapest coins anywhere, make sure you guys check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Zerk's Fanatic today with another Madden Ultimate Team video and today we have the next episode of Mutt Bingo. I do want to give a shout out to Noah Stratton for being a part of the Noti Gang. If you guys have a chance to shout out the next video, drop a like in the vid, make sure you guys are subbed to the channel, to notification blonde, and comment down below Noti Gang. And also, I am going first, so this video should be up hopefully around like uh, probably 10.45 a.m. Eastern Time. Dom's video, maybe later this afternoon, maybe tomorrow. Be on the lookout for Dom's video. Also, since this video is going up before 1 p.m., make sure you guys go ahead and check out Underdog Fantasy. You can use code Zerk right now to match your first deposit up to $100. And I'm actually doing a giveaway over on Twitter, which I will link in the comment section. Uh, for your guys' support, seriously, thank you guys so much for all the support with Underdog Fantasy. It has been absolutely incredible. So I want to say thank you very much. So I am doing a $50 giveaway. All you have to do, click on the link to the Twitter uh, post. You just got to retweet it, follow me, and comment Zerk Luck. That's all I gotta do. Now, also the loser of Mutt Bingo every single week does have to give away a $10 gift card. So if I lose, I'll have to give one away. So go ahead and drop a like in the video. Make sure you're subbed and comment down below. We'll go with G Fuel, which by the way is 30% uh, off right now through November 23rd. Comment down below G Fuel and make sure you guys leave a way to contact you, like a Twitter or Instagram, because if you don't, then you will not win. Also, I need you to comment some stuff down below for what should be the top comment on this video the middle piece and the middle piece for this episode is an interesting one again you guys are kind of bringing up uh stuff to put in the board that really makes me think okay is this player you know been doing this whatever because the middle piece for this week is a player who has been in the league for eight or more years so eight or more years I'm gonna maybe miss out on a player. Maybe I won't. Eight or more years. I guess that's not the hardest thing to remember. It just depends on who's in the pack. But with that being said, let's get right into it. And hopefully, right, the goal really every single week with my bingo would be to pull a limited because that's instant bingo. But if you get under 10 packs, it's not a guaranteed win, but it's pretty close to it. So if we could get bingo here in under 10 packs, that's really what we're aiming for here as do get 82 overall william jackson right there we also get amari cooper round number two i'll sell him for a big flash okay mike haynes base elite oh no big flash okay so we didn't get a big flash we did get an 88 troy p though so obviously i could go with the middle piece here but i feel like unless we get something crazy I almost feel like the move every single week is to go with that legend because I feel like the odds of us getting an 85 plus and power up are pretty easy, which is kind of why we're looking to make the board four by four really soon here because we've noticed that we've been hitting the left side just so much because it is pretty easy to get 85 plus now to get a golds, whatever. Um, I mean, Troy P obviously did play for eight plus years, but I, I think I'm just going to go with Legend here because it is kind of hard to pull Legends. And so one pack in and we got Legend out of the way. As I did just say, yeah, we are definitely looking to expand the board to 4x4. Now that we actually have more promos and everything we potentially put on here. But on to pack number two. Give me an Elite. Throw me an Elite. Yes. Okay, so we got an Elite. Leonard Fournette. He has not played for eight plus years. I can tell you that. However, Leonard Fournette is a cover athlete team player. Well, that was pack number two right there. And I have to say, this next pack could be really critical because if it's even an 80 overall player, right? Then that would be pack number three and we could get two elites in a row. And then all we have to do is pull a player who's been in the league for A plus years or a campus hero. So Leonard Fournette, can we get an elite here? Pack three, elite. No, that could have been it right there. Jonah Jackson, see? I don't even know who this guy is. Has he been in the league for eight plus years? I kind of doubt it. Now, I thought he looked a little bit too young there. Yeah, definitely has not been in the league for uh, eight plus years right there. So that was pack number three. On to pack four. Okay, it's a gold. Donovan Smith. Donovan Smith, he's a younger player as well. I know that. So that was pack four right there. We get Donovan Smith. We already have cover athlete team out of the way. Pack number five. Oh, man, I want an elite. Pack five, Zach Cunningham. I'm almost positive that Zach Cunningham is like in his fifth year or like fourth year. Oh yeah, he hasn't been in the league for eight plus years there. I was 
pretty positive about that, that he was a younger player. On to pack number six, though, I believe. Okay, gold again. Pack six to gold. Oh, Jimmy. Jimmy Graham has definitely played for eight plus years. All right, so pack number six, we got Jimmy Graham, who obviously has played for eight plus years, or there he is a very, very uh, veteran player. So really, we have a couple of different ways to get a bingo now, but an 85 plus would be an instant bingo. That's pack seven, Nate Solder as well. I believe he's played for eight plus years now, I think probably. Next pack though, we do get an elite, not an 85, not an 85 plus. However, okay, there's an elite so if we get another elite on this next pack it is a bingo so we could get bingo right here we could get it come on elite no a rookie a rookie really okay how many more packs do we have left here let me let me back all the way out just so you guys can see this you know i'm not cheating i did not cheat my bingo let's see how many packs we have left two more packs so that means we are currently on pack number nine so this is pack 10 right here Please, 85 plus. 85 plus. No, a gold. Pack 10. And this is going to be pack 11 right here. Give me an 85 plus overall. Please. Please. A gold. All right. Well, we're over. That's pack 11 right there. All right. So that was pack number 11 right there. And, you know, if we get to like 20 or so, that's not a good sign. That is not a good sign because usually, you know, if you don't get bingo before 10, you can usually get it between 10 to 20. So we badly need to pull like an 85 plus overall here. Pack number 12, a 79 plus and I get a gold. A 79 plus and I get a gold. Really? Really? Pack number 13. What do we get? What is that? Oh, that is, that is not that. That is the NAT team voter right there. Pack number 13 now with a get a gold plus player. Pack 13. Okay, 86. Really? Really? That was pack 13 we get jerry tillery number 14 legend really man are you kidding me EA? are you kidding me pack 14 it's not an 85 plus but it's it's a legend really number 15 oh man i, I didn't even think about that if we could have gotten an elite right there that would have been bingo as well so again double no bingo number 16 Okay, we get a power up. That's going to help a lot. All right, so pack 16, we get the best cornerback in the NFL. And I could have gone with favorite team, but I'm not going to. Also, that was an elite. And we get back-to-back -back elites. There we go. KJ Wright. I know, well, that counts as an elite because he's an 80 overall power up, right? I know, I, I know that it's a power up, but it still counts as an elite because it's an elite power up. 80 overall. 80 overall is elite. So absolutely that counts and just to showcase this okay i'm gonna i'm gonna back out here to, and let me double check so that was pack 17 so that was pack 17 and just to show this you guys can see right here right if i go over to trayvon Diggs, and then i go over to where is it gonna be at i know it should show if he's like elite category which obviously he's you know the best nfl player i guess if i like sort in my item binder i suppose by um by elite if I do that and he pops up, we're counting it. We are counting that as two elites in a row because it is. It's an 80 overall. And there you guys can see. Sort by elite, Diggs pops up. Doesn't matter if he's a power up because obviously every other thing is elite too. And I know that makes perfect sense to probably majority of you guys, but I know there's probably somebody out there that's thinking, well, how can that count for bingo if Trayvon Diggs is a power up? Well, because it's an 80 overall elite. So it took us 17 packs to get bingo. And surprisingly so, it wasn't down the left side right there. Let me go ahead and end off the rest of these packs. Let's just see what we got. We got a power up. Really? How interesting is that? We got Trayvon Diggs. Then we got his brother, Stefan Diggs. Okay, that's kind of cool there. Uh, we get a Cowboys player. So right there would have been favorite team if I wanted to go with that. Next one here. A 75, and let me guess, I didn't pull a single 85 plus in, out of 21 pack. Oh, really? 86? Yep, there it is. So literally on pack 21, we would have gotten 86 overall Pat Pete. So that would have been the 85 plus right there, but we ended up getting a bingo. So hopefully you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure you guys drop a like on it, and of course, hit that sub button down below. As I said, Dom's video should be up either later today, tomorrow, whenever his video is up, so make sure you guys look out for that. But let's end this video off with a Legends Fantasy Pack, because these packs have been really, really good for me, so I want to just do one last one here, as do get Michael Carter. We also get Charlie Joyner. Let's go with the 70 Ebron, I guess. Round number two, most feared. Could be good. 
or not 85 84 and 88 overall marquise pouncey not the craziest ever so hopefully you guys did enjoy the video see you guys next time